up, guys? I'm at SHOT Show. As you know, SHOT Show is not all about guns. It's also about knives and all the other gear as well. And I almost don't need to tell the world who you are. Right? you got your own YouTube channel. You're on TV at one point. But uh, introduce yourself to the world, and then we'll talk about what the knife. So I'm Dave Canterbury from Pathfinder School of Self-Reliance Outfitters. And the newest release from Mora Knives this year at SHOT is the Carbon Steel Full Tang Mora Garber. We've got a full tang Mora knife here made out of carbon steel. It's got a little over a four inch blade, Scandinavian grind. It's got a coating on it that's actually impregnated into the metal, so it does not affect its ability to strike flint and steel. It also has a 90 degree spine so that you can drive sparks from a ferrocerium rod or process tinder materials. And it has a special Crichton handle material that's virtually indestructible. Blade goes all the way through the back of the handle so that it can be used for not only pounding into to break open material that you may need to get into like rotten logs and things like that. It can also be used to scrape your ferrocerium rod. And of course, it's a full tank blade so you don't have to be afraid to baton the crap out of it if nice. you need to. Very cool. And then uh, the sheath it comes with? It comes with two different sheath options. It comes with the standard multi-mount sheath that the stainless steel garber came with. It also comes with a leather sheath as well. So you can get that either way. You can get it with the multi-mount, which oh, is a nice. plastic sheath, or you can get it with a leather sheath. MSRP is like 89 and 99 respectively. That's that's probably the, the craziest thing, right? Is you get all those features, all that durability, all that utility for such a low price. You know, I think that's probably the truth about the moral line. If you look at just the leather sheath, I mean, I've been carrying the same leather sheath for three years for this mm -hmm. knife, and it's never let me down. And a quality leather sheath is about 50 bucks. And then you look at a knife like this that's pretty much guaranteed for life and add another 50 bucks to it. Now you got 100 bucks in this package and you've got something that's going to last you for the rest of your lifetime and probably your kids as well if you take care of it. Very cool. And then I see you have other knives here as well. Can you talk about what, what these other knives are? We've got the original Garber, which was stainless steel. Virtually the same everything with the knife except for the material. Stainless, carbon. Comes in the same sheath options as the more Garber stainless or uh, carbon does. You've got the Eldris, which is basically just a utility knife. It's a small blade with a multiple grind option. It's good for skinning. It's good for fine carving work. Think about the old retractable utility knives. That's pretty much what this is in a nutshell. It comes with a neck style carry sheath and a ferrocerium rod. It also comes with a locking system. Oh, I see. So you cannot lose So it. now there's no way you can lose this. And you know, my favorite option for carry on this knife is just to take this lanyard out of it, put a split ring through there like a keychain, and you can hang that thing right on your PFD in a kayak or a canoe. You can put that thing on the webbing of your backpack, and you've got that knife right there, that utility knife, all the time that you're never going to lose. And it's not hanging around your neck yeah. where it can hang in the woods. It's actually attached to your backpack. So you've got that option as well. And then you've also got the option with this knife now of taking all of this stuff off and putting a belt loop on the knife. So that if you wanted oh, to cool. carry it in normal fashion, you just snap the belt loop on it and you can carry it on your belt like a normal belt carry knife. So you got a lot of options in that knife and it's a really good utilitarian knife, life knife. Like I said, this is just like the old retractable utility knife, mm -hmm. same concept. Cool. Bushcraft Black, this is the original Bushcraft knife that was made by Mora. High carbon steel, nine degree spine, about a four and a half inch blade, very, very comfortable handle. This knife is not full tang, but I've never been able to break one of these and I've tried. So it's a very robust knife, and this is the knife we recommend to our students at the Pathfinder School. As the first knife to start out with as a bushcraft knife is the bushcraft block. I have that knife. Yeah, yeah that's a fantastic blade. Yeah. Very cool. Oh, I appreciate the uh, rundown oh, no problem, on all brother. the new knives. That's okay, and it was man. a pleasure meeting you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Awesome. Man. And uh, let's end this with a website. So if you guys want to learn more, what's their website? You can go website? to www.selfrelianceoutfitters.com. Awesome. Right. Thanks a lot, man. Okay, buddy. Thank you.